Welcome to God's Playbook with your host, Father Rico Passero. Lock is a 20, 10, 5, touchdown! Touchdown! Let's play ball. Happy feast day to all you athletes out there. Today is the feast of St. Sebastian, the patron saint of athletes, soldiers, and many other groups of people. But certainly when you're on a Catholic sports podcast, today's the day. St. Sebastian, pray for us. So friends, let's talk about St. Sebastian. I know as a priest, when I speak to my confirmation classes in regards to choosing a patron saint, Sebastian is a very popular one with the young men and women who are athletic. And as soon as they type in patron saint of athletes, their decision has been made. St. Sebastian lived the years 255 to 288. So he was in his early 30s when he was martyred for his faith. So what do we know about St. Sebastian or Sebastiano? Well, Sebastiano lived in Rome in Italy. And so he's Italian as well. So there's another connection for those of us who are of Italian heritage. But St. Sebastian was a young man who was very passionate about his faith. And we know that he, because of his faith, was martyred. He was killed during the Diocletian killing of Christians at that time. And tradition tells us that he was first tied up and he'll often be seen with three arrows protruding from his body. But yet it was not the arrows that killed him. Rather, Sebastian was taken down, brought forward to the emperor, and was later clubbed to death as a result of his reluctance to give up his faith. So while on paper it looks like, oh, he's the patron saint of athletes, so any good athlete should be asking St. Sebastian to help them. But actually, friends, we need to start at a faith perspective and realize that St. Sebastian, as depicted in art as a very muscular, fit young man who probably liked playing sports, whether it was, you know, Italy's passionate game of soccer or not, the reality is it is his faith in the Lord Jesus that sustained him. It's his faith in the Lord Jesus that he exhibited true courage and that the groups of people, like the soldiers that are also under the patronage of St. Sebastian, should take their courage from this fine young man who was willing to stand up to the emperor and all of the violent attacks and threats that were brought upon him as he trusted that the Lord would see him through. So for each of us, whether we are athletic in nature, like your host, or perhaps those of you who could care less about sports but just love our podcast, may St. Sebastian intercede for each of us, especially those who have taken on his name at confirmation. Let us pray. Lord our God, we thank you for the gift of St. Sebastian, whose feast day we celebrate today. We ask that through his intercession, you may continue to protect and give strength to soldiers throughout the world, especially those who are fighting for peace and for the rights of human beings throughout the world. We also pray for all athletes that they may continue to perform those who are professionals and provide for their families, those of us who are amateurs who just enjoy the sport itself, that we can play the games we play, having fun, developing our skill, and remaining safe. And most importantly, through the intercession of St. Sebastian, Lord, may we grow in our relationship with you. May we be more courageous in regards to standing up for our faith and grow in your image and likeness. We ask these in all things through Christ our Lord. Amen. St. Sebastian, pray for us. For God's Playbook, I'm Father Rico. God loves you and so do I. If you like what you hear, please consider supporting us on our Ko-Fi, K-O-F-I, or GoFundMe at God's Playbook Podcast. Thanks and God bless.